if the writer knows who is corrupt at ESCOM, let him expose that. And I'm going to write to him through our lawyers. He must prove within 10 or 7 days what he said. He's a lawyer, he can come, but we'll meet in court. I challenge him. I, he must name those people whom he say they are corrupt, and then uh, he must deal with, it, with them himself. We welcome the immediate departure as the ANC of Mr. Director from ESCOM as announced. He has completely failed to deliver on this contractual obligation. Instead, he shifts the goalposts by advertising his right-wing ideological posture. You are the CEO. Expose corruption. We challenge you so that law enforcement can deal with it. If there are corrupt people who are promoting corruption, they happen to have the label of being ANC members or serve in any capacity in government. The Raider and others have got an obligation to expose them. The ANC is not corrupt. We will in no way mask or uh, protect corrupt individuals. He must not say that the ANC wants a piece of cake in renewable and just transition a program of government. I am speaking on behalf of the ANC and I challenge him that if he's got anything he must come to me and he must go to the police that here is somebody in the entity talking on behalf of the ANC and demanding this and that and all professionals not only the writer serving in the SOEs must act ethical 